I'm very pleased with how this class came together. Um, you know, certainly two of them have been with us for a while. They committed to us a year ago. Uh, I like the size. We're big and we're long. And I think we've kind of evolved into something where the bigger we can be at every position, the more beneficial that's going to be. Um, we also have three guys that are very good with the basketball. They play different positions, but they can pass and catch. Their ball skills are, are really good. And, and that's another strength and a thing that's been an identity of our program. Everybody on the floor is good with the ball. Everybody on the floor can pass it. Again, basketball IQ guys, flexible, versatile guys. I think uh, when we looked at last year's team and the success we had, we loved the versatility of interchangeable parts. I think with these three, you really have interchangeable parts on both ends of the floor. Cameron Bishad, uh, you know, a 6'6", plays any position on the perimeter. You know, maybe could even be your second big guy sometimes as we stretch defenses with guys like that. Uh, but great with the ball, ability to score off the dribble. He, he has a knack. He's a different player than Luke Herringote, but here's a similar trait. He has a knack for finding the basket. He can score that ball from a lot of different spots. Shoot it from three, off the dribble, can finish at the basket. He gets fouled. He makes free throws. Good speed, really good length. I think he will become a very good defender because of his speed and his wingspan. Um, the biggest thing with him is getting strength on him, as it has been with a lot of our young guys. But the natural ball skills and the ability to play really any position on the perimeter uh, makes him uh, uh, an impact guy for us right away. Zach August is that flexible four man that we've had good success with. Um, he could step out and shoot the ball. He's comfortable with the basketball. But maybe what I love the most is his length around the basket. He plays above the rim. He'll be a shot blocker for us, a little bit like what Carlton Scott gave us with that wingspan, and he can score it around the bucket. Um, but again, what you love, for a 6'10 guy, he's good with the ball anywhere on the court. Austin Burgett, it was the first one to commit to us in this class, and um, thrilled with him because he's so good with the ball. He, he can almost be a little bit of a point forward. Remember how we used Ty Nash, handling the ball in transition handling the ball up top to give our point guard a blow. Austin Burgett's going to get to that point in our program. Can shoot it and stretch a defense. Very athletic, kind of sneaky athletic. He'll be one of the top guys with our vertical jump. But out of that mold of our forwards, Scott Martin, Abramitis, Rob Kurz, who have a feel for the game and know how to play, Austin Burgett fits that mold. Well, I think for these three guys that we're going to sign, the, the thing that's really neat about it is we're going to go on a foreign tour this summer, and they can be part of it. So they are going to get a taste of our practices, 10 practices in the summer. That will give them a great head start to being integrated into our program. Certainly they'll be here academically. That's helped us. And being in our strength program with Tony Relinsky, and then we're going to go up to Toronto and play some exhibition games. So for these three, there's probably, it's really a key time to come, and we need them, so we want to get them a head start. But I think by October 15th, the first day of practice of their freshman year, they're going to be miles ahead of other classes we've had.